What's up guys, welcome back to another video and today we're going to be taking a look at the Kiloton Radium Rifle. A very special unique version of the normal Radium Rifle that does explosive damage. And you guys know, if you've been keeping up on the channel, that the explosive legendary effect is hands down the best legendary effect in Fallout 4. And because of this, the Kiloton Radium Rifle is hands down one of the best weapons you can pick up from the Far Harbor DLC expansion. So how do you actually get this? Well, it's pretty damn easy to obtain. It's actually purchasable from a vendor known as Kane inside of the Nucleus. Now, as many of you guys may or may not know, the Nucleus is pretty much the Children of Atom hideout or headquarters, I guess you could say. And to actually unlock Kane uh, as somebody you can barter with, or I guess a vendor, you need to have progressed a little bit into the Children of Atom quest line. It's not, you don't have to, you know, physically join them and side with them completely, but you do need to complete a bunch of their side quests and a few of their main quests to actually get him to become a vendor for you. So just go ahead and progress through it a little bit, you know, keep checking back to him after you complete a few quests and he will eventually become available to barter with. Now what's crazy about this is that the weapon is very very cheap. You would think for a weapon like this it would co probably cost somewhere near to like the 10,000 ish caps mark. Some of the weapons that aren't even as good as this one cost you know much more but it's anywhere between 500 to 2,000 caps give or take your character build and there are various other look factors and stuff like that but yeah, it's a very cheap weapon you can purchase from him. It has pretty much a cluster of effects. I mean, not only are you doing general damage, you're doing, of course, radiation damage, and you're also doing explosive damage, which, of course, is this kind of three-way effect that packs a punch against any enemy in the game. And that, my friends, is how you obtain the Kiloton Radium Rifle. Now, I'm going to start slowing down a little bit on the individual weapon guides, and that is because I plan to do them in compilation forms instead. So... Tomorrow, I'm probably going to put out a top 10 rare or unique weapons found in Far Harbor. Uh, if you do want to stay tuned for that, it's either going to be tomorrow or the day afterwards on Sunday. Uh, but for the most part, we have three more videos going up today on some unique armor. We have a bunch more different types of videos as well. So stay tuned for those. Subscribe for more videos similar to this. Top fives, we're going to be doing a bunch of those as well uh, throughout the week. And I'll catch you guys next time with a brand new video. Peace out.